Have you ever seen a plant where you have trouble identifying it? You take a photo, you compare the photo against standard references, perhaps Margaret Felice's book, or Calflora, or Jepson, but you still don't know what it is. The natural thing is to ask a friend. This website now has the ability for you to submit photos of plants that you need help identifying and get help from others. So let me show you how it works. First of all, this is part of the main website on common and noteworthy plants in the Torrey Pines Reserve. It's a new menu item called Plant ID Help. To get to the website in the first place, there are several ways. The easiest way is simply to go directly there. This is the URL for that. But you can also get to it on the Docents website in the training materials under Margaret Phillies' class or going to the public-facing Nature Center Plants TPSNR Plants tutorial. This is the way you'd get to it from the training page. Scroll down to the entry for Margaret Phillies' class, March 18th. Click on TPSNR Plants tutorial. It takes you to this website. Look over to Plant ID Help. There are two items. Plant ID Help is the one you go to to submit a photo. So let's click on that. This is what that page looks like. It's got directions, guidelines about how to submit a photo. You type in your name, you answer how much one and one is in order to prevent spam, and then you upload your file. But you have to be logged in or registered with the website to use it. So even though the website itself, you can view all the content without having a login. To submit stuff, you need to register. Click on that register button, takes you to the login page. You don't have a login, you click on register and it takes you here. You provide a username that you make up, provide your email, and then click on register. That will then send some email to you and help you complete the process. Once you've done that, you can then go to the page we were just at, or here's a mystery plants page also in that tab, that shows you plants that other people have submitted. If you think you know what it is, you can click on the reply, and here's one person's answer. It looks like California figwort to me. It's good to give an explanation of why, what it is that makes you think it is that plant, and of course other people can weigh in later. That's pretty much it. So again, the access is either through the URL directly, training materials, or the Nature Center on the docents website. One final thing. Obviously, if nobody looks at the photos you're posting to help you identify them, you'll never get help. So you're strongly encouraged to urge your friends, other docents, to check in periodically, look at the Mystery Plants page, and volunteer their identifications. Uh, the more people who do, um, the more useful this tool will be. Enjoy!